How do you all and welcome back to Immersion Gaming. Right. Got me fresh orange. My sweets. Right, so we are on the concluding episode of episode one. Uh, sorry, season one of Minecraft Story Mode. So, um, straight away after we finish season one, um, we'll be playing season two straight away without any trailer in between or all that. Because the trailer I did, I did for both season one and season two at the same time. So, because it's near enough, it's the same game really, and it? it's just a, a sequel. So. I don't know if it's going to be the same characters or what, but I'm sure it'll be just as good, whether or not it's the same characters. So yeah, bring, without further ado, let's crack straight on, shall we? Mm, give me some of them sweeties. Right, so, where did we leave it last night? Oh yeah, we've just come out of that... Um, that world where they were, it was a bit like the Borg, wasn't it? Where they were all being controlled by a central computer. That one of the old builders, as they call them, one of the original builders that built everything. Um, they, she built this computer to try and make everything more efficient. Um, but it took over. A bit like AI now at the moment. It took over and realised that it were more efficient than humans were. And it found a way to control all the humans by putting a chip on the back of the red. Um, and they all became like zombies because of it. So, anyway, we sorted that world out. We destroyed the computer so all the people were back to normal. And the, her that built the computer, one of the original builders, came back with us to that room where all the portals are. Um, and said that there were a way to go to where all the rest of the original builders are um, and she opened a secret door for us with that heart that we took out the computer and that's where it ended so now we are going to see all these other old school builders um, to find the portal we need to get back to our own realm so without further ado let's crack on with Minecraft Story Mode Season 1 Episode 8 a journey's end. Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. If these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer. That's not what I was expecting. See, <clears throat> this is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. It would be nice if whoever made these left some sort of signs, guideposts. You can call me Harper. Your bravery is an impressive quality. I look forward to studying that aspect of your personality once you have been made useful. We'll see about that. No. What is that? This is the Redstone Heart. Beautiful. It can help you find your way home. How is this going to do that? The answers you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home, they're all right up those stairs. Adventure? And that's where we left it. So I wonder what they've been doing then, these old builders, if they're still in this same building where all these portals are. Wow, that... That's a lot of stairs. And why she left them and went into that and world all revealed built that computer by the redstone heart. Sure we'll find Amazing. out now. Yeah, not bad, right? My heart. After you. Okay, guys, I'm not sure what's up there, but whatever it is, we all need to stick together. You got it? Yeah, we've got your back, Jesse. Let's do the shit! Ah, feels like just yesterday we were building this place. Still don't agree <coughs> with some of the aesthetic choices. Very odd to be back. Oh, you just love being mysterious, don't you? 
Is that like your favorite thing? <laughs> like, I don't know what you're talking about. I just try not to think about this place very often. Kind of thought I'd never need to come back to tell you the truth. Wow. That's not weird. Oh, I'm sensing a story here. I guess you could say that. You don't sound super happy about being back. What's up? Yeah, I think you'll figure it out once you meet the others. <laughs> others? You mean we're going to meet more old builders? Still don't like it when you call us that. Yep, but I gotta <laughs> warn you, they're not as friendly as I am. I've been walking down with Big Stunk on. Nicest old builder. Because he's mean uh -huh. old builders. Old builder social politics. My goodness. <laughs> hey, I'm just glad you're on our side. Old builder or not, you've been pretty cool. Well, thank you, Jesse. I hope I can keep living up to that. Well, you're gonna give us the Atlas and then we can go home, right? Kind of. <laughs> the Atlas isn't exactly mine to give. No, it belongs here we go. to the other, uh, old builders. And, well, they might not want to give it up. Well, you could have said that before we came. Why do I get the feeling there's a lot you're not telling us? Good instincts? I'm sure we can figure something out, make a deal with them, right? Oh, yeah. They love making deals. <laughs> You'll see when you get there. Jesse. Come here. Are you sure we can trust Harper? Look at all of our interactions with her so far. They haven't exactly been great, remember? Yeah, I do. She saved our lives, Lucas. Only after she put them in danger. If I remember correctly, <laughs> we saved her just about as much as she saved us. Don't worry, okay? We're gonna get that Atlas and get home. I appreciate the vote of confidence, Jesse. Sorry. I just couldn't resist a good eavesdrop. I promise I'm trying to help, Lucas. You just gotta go through there. A, a door? Like a regular door? Time to step through and find out. A bit cryptic like, isn't she? I think I'd be like Lucas. Very what? bright. Oh. See a thing. Before you go in there, I have one more piece of advice. Don't die! What? <laughs> oh, so what I wrong to trust her then. What the hell? do we have here? Seems as if some new competitors have entered the match. My, isn't that special? I just... What in the world did Harper dump us into? Wait, where's Harper? She didn't come with us. Uh, getting very tired of old builders. Hang on. I just realized what this reminds me of. Spleef. Home Is game. it tight? No, it's a game. You try to knock the floor out from other people and make them fall. Ah, be like this! Eat shit, motherfucker! Oh. That was my only decent teammate! <laughs> Don't even trunch ball. I fucked it now. Oops, did face me drop something? Heads up! I'll help Petra. Get Ivor, quick! Wow, nice one, Jesse. That was close. <gasps> Ivor! Lucas! They can't be no. dead. But it can't be. Whoa, no way, dude. I got a double. <laughs> Hey, whoa! This is a misunderstanding, dude! What are you doing? Hey! Using weapons is against the rules! Rules? Oh, is it just a not game? Cool, so dude. they're not really so dead? Not cool. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Stop the I repeat, slap is down! Stop the match! Not since the days of Tim have we seen such heated play. That's totally against the rules, right? Yeah. I didn't think we could throw TNT back at the gladiators. Nice one, bro. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Whoa. Now, I and think... now you're just trying to be all buddy buddy? You killed one of my best friends. Hey, I don't care about your compliments, and I'm definitely not your bra. Whoa. 
Hang on, dude. I am not in charge here, okay? It's them. Yes, they all we are the ones it. in charge here. And we have never had to stop a match. Ever. It definitely is strange, Mavia. What is going on here? I want an explanation. Immediately. <laughs> This is my app. I think this is going here. to require some reconfiguring of the stats for sure. My friends are dead. You killed them. Wait, wait, wait. A and that's why you're ruining our games? Yeah, come on. Jeez, how petty are you? Ugh, lashing out just because your friends were eliminated. Kind of sore loser behavior, don't you think, sport? It is part of the games. Oh, I've got a game we could play. I'll go first. Are you People, crazy people are dying out here. And you're still talking about games? Oh, wow. You don't know, do you? Your friends aren't dead. Wait, <laughs> what? what? So. How? When people are eliminated in the games, they don't die. <laughs> that would be wasteful. <laughs> Obviously. They come back, and then we have them go work in the mines. Jesse! <gasps> <clears throat> Your friends are alive and well. It's just a game. Let my friends go. Sorry, sport, but they were eliminated. <laughs> the one in the game? Them's the rules. It's called respawning, champ. We're not monsters. <clears throat> in our games, when people die, they reappear in one of our respawn zones. I hear it's still pretty painful, though. Well, Sport, now that you've come and interrupted our games, I'm sure our fans would love to know how you got here. Spill! Oh, why bother? They all end up in the mines. Stairs. Lots of them. Are you being a Weisenheimer with me? Is that really what's going on? Wow. Say, so can we get someone to kill this little moron for me, please, a few dozen times? <laughs> Easy, Hadrian. Jesse's with me. Well, if it isn't Harper. I must say, this return is unexpected. You're telling me I'm here for Jesse. Oh, really? So tell me, Jim, why do you think Harper brought you here? My bet's on Pet. That'd be pretty cute, right? Oh, adorable. We just want to get our friends and go home. Sorry, Chief, but this... Is your home now? Might as well get comfy. No way. We've been lost in your stupid portal hallway long enough. We're going home. Meaning, you need my atlas. Very interesting. Well, that's all well and good, but I'm confused. Why would we give anything to someone like you? You weren't invited. And you interrupted Spleef. Yeah, ask Harper. She's the one helping. Um, right. Yes. Believe me, Hadrian, when you see what Jesse has, let's just say it will pique your interest. I doubt you'd have anything that would interest us. Oh, send them to the mines. They're cheaters. Let's make their lives miserable. What about this? Huh? I present the Redstone Heart. Huh. Seems like only yesterday someone took off with that and vowed never to return with it. Oh, but I didn't bring it back. Jesse did. Things no toy, slugger. How about you just hand it over? How about no It could be uh, it's pretty dangerous if you don't know how to use it. <coughs> Harper. <laughs> nah, uh Hadrian, you're not getting one finger on this thing until you hand over my friend. I'm not a big fan of haggling, Jesse. Here's no the what? Way. My Lamb chops. You give me the heart. You and your friends go back down to those portals. I never look at your insignificant face again. Wait, without the Atlas? But how will we get home? So, not my problem. This is a one-time offer. Clearly things have been getting out of hand. Let's start over and see if we can reach an agreement. Okay, okay, fine. I can always appreciate someone trying to be reasonable. Well, you need the Atlas. And I... Need competitors. After your unexpected intrusion, I seem to be short a team. So how about this? You play in the games. If you win, 
The Atlas is yours to keep. It's a good deal, Jesse. Trust me. Everyone enjoys these games. It really does take a big person to admit when they've met their match, right, Hadrian? Yeah, that's right, Slugger. I'll play these games. Bring it on. Well, I guess we have a deal then. Gravel. All right then. I suppose we can carry forward with the official oh, event. Enough. Add it on your own time. Oh, but there's one other thing I want. If they lose, Harper has to go to the mines too. Oh, gravel. Harper, want to be a friend and show our new competitors to where they'll be staying? Sure thing. Great. Looks like we're fighting for his lives then, doesn't it? Jesse, this was not part of the plan. Wrapped up in one of Hadrian's deals. Ugh. He's not one to let other people get the upper hand, you know. Wait, but this was your plan. You said you had it all worked out. Yeah, about that. I didn't think you'd willingly come here. I might have acted in haste before uh, I could work out all the details. You don't say? Ugh. I'm, s I'm sorry, okay? I really am. Let me show you where the competitor village is. Well, there's no point freaking crying over spelt milk because uh, we're here now. So, we know what we need to do. Either that or take them all on, it's one over, isn't it? We used to have competitors from all over travel here to play in the games. At least until the others ruined it. What happened? Hadrian and Mevia let power go to their heads. They started pitting people against each other, just for sport. Forcing people to be here. It isn't right. It's like Hunger Games, isn't it, a bit? Come on, I'll show you where you'll be just staying. Just they're not dying, they're going to work in mines. Well, here it is. The competitor village. Sort of a home away from home for all the people playing the games. And she's like Olympic village before they go to Olympic Games. Wait, are all of these people competitors? Yep. At least the ones who aren't stuck working in the quartz mines. Those poor souls are just waiting for their next shot. Mining is tough work. I feel bad for the people that are too scared or weak to play in the games. Wow, that's just horrible. I know. I guess that's why Harper left them then, because she don't agree with all... She didn't agree with that. They didn't make a deal like you did, Jesse. They're stuck here till they win the games. And what if they lose? Hadrian sends them to toil in the mines. If they're lucky, they'll get another shot at the games. But it might take a while. I'm going to go confer with Otto. We go way back and, well, he's usually the most reasonable of the three. Wait, we still haven't found Lucas or Ivor. I'm thinking that Hadrian must have sent them through the portal to the mines. Which is technically against the rules. No one's supposed to go there until their whole team is eliminated. Huh, seems like Hadrian's trying to make sure we all know who's boss. You always did catch on quick. See what you can do here. I'm going to try and find Otto. I've got confidence in you, Jesse. You might just get out of this. There is no might of. That's the only option. We gotta get our friends out of another. the mines quick. I'll go ask some of the other competitors. Either Adrian's getting bummed with no lube, or we win this blinging game. Hey, Jesse. Finding your way around all right? Yeah, starting to. Nice. You know, this place would actually be a blast if it weren't for the whole against their will thing. I mean, Spleef was awesome, but a little bit of the fun gets taken away when you're forced to do something. No way. With the old builders controlling everything? This place stinks. Yeah, I guess. Let's keep trying to find Ivor and Lucas. Agreed. Hey there. Nice my weekend.
better get some steps in for the big games. Well, hello there, little punks. Wow, they look focused. They must really want to win this thing. Well, they don't want to lose, do they, Jesse? Do you want to lose and go and work it back? If they wanted that, then they'd be in the shovel games. planet. Nice. Hey, Pink! Hey! hey. Get out of here before I see if I can attach this sign to your head. <laughs> Why don't you try? It's so nice when new contestants are in the village. It's lovely having fresh meat for us gladiators to destroy. Yeesh, why is everyone so cranky around here? Could be that we're forced into an endless cycle of destruction. Just a guess, though. <laughs> what exactly do you do here? Well, when I'm not in the arena of being a great gladiator, I hand out the daily food rations and guard the food, so no one tries to sneak any. Have you happened to see my friends? You know, the ones that got eliminated in Spleef? No, but if I do, I will make them wish for elimination again. Fine, I'm out of here. Bye-bye! Can't wait to kill you again! Well, you didn't kill me last time, did you? So it's not again. Excuse me? Psh, wow, rude. <laughs> Manners much. So they're there, so wait a minute. He's there. Uh, well, the OL's the gelatin there. Uh, let's have a look over here. Nell. from Spleef. You were like amazing. I know, bro. And I am so super sorry about your friend. I get your prods upset, especially since you had no idea what was going on. <laughs> Speaking of my friends, have you seen them lately? Nope, sorry. They're like probably in the mines and that's on me. <sighs> Such bad karma, bad karma. I will never do that to one of your friends again because man, I do not want to be on your bad side. You've not even seen say, his bad side you keep yet. Playing like that and you have, like Tim status. Tim who? Tim, like the legend of Tim Tim on the signs. <laughs> like oh one, okay? Like you could, people could like already be talking. They're gonna Tim, like Tim say or Tim Tim. Compare you to Tim. I'm not here to be a Tim. I just want to get home. But that's like exactly what makes you Tim status. Tim didn't want to be Tim either. He got his whole team home. Listen, I still feel super bad about taking out your friend. I owe you. So if you ever need anything, you just come and ask. Shall? <laughs> okay then, brah. Thanks for the help. Uh, hey. You're the one that eliminated the one decent member of my team. I'll get over it, Miss Trunchbull. I'll barely be able to get through to the next round. I mean, I know I'm good at this, but I'm not that good. Your stupid teammate killed Lucas. Yeah, I couldn't believe Nell pulled that off either. Don't forget they respawned, duh. Don't pry about it. We were doing what we had to do to win. Until you screwed up everything. <laughs> Next round. If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will. <sighs> you haven't oh, been here really? long, so you wouldn't know. But the gladiators are trained for everything, and they are completely under Hadrian's control. Good luck, Em. I know that the best person will win. Seriously? You know you're looking at the best person. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. Looks like Tim won. 
Yeah, Tim. Yeah, well, good luck with getting home. Well, that don't fill us with confidence at all. It's like she's saying that this Tim thing's a load of bollocks, basically, isn't she? Wooden plank, solid. <sighs> Just turns around and walks up away. I don't want to go down there, bro. Old Pink Mohican looking for his punch bag. Impressive. Wow, hey, you are that crazy person in extreme spleef. Decent. Not as good as Tim, but decent. That's more than I can say for most. But not even a third of what Tim was. So, you ever meet Tim? Me? Meet Tim? Oh, I wish. Here's the secret. We're all just trying to be like Tim. Never. You don't He's say. He's perfect. Okay, I'll leave you to it then. Wide on! <sighs> It'll be frigging uh, seeping all over. Courtyard, please. While talking about Tim. Just a little seepage. Hey, that's Lucas's journal. You say something, Tiny? Because I'm trying to read here. Hey, where'd you get that book you're reading? Oh, this? Fished it out some respawns inventory after he... <sighs> it's got some tales of adventure, feelings, yeah. and other Our dumb adventures. stuff. Hey, wait a minute. You're the pipsqueak that knocked me out of my tower. Yeah, and this belonged to that little blonde buddy of yours. Let me guess. You want this back? Because I'm actually enjoying myself. There are some fascinating and thrilling tales in here. Hey, don't get too steam. Maybe we can make a deal? And Slam, the immovable. Oh, we can make a deal. If you do everything I say, when I say it, and don't make me mad again, maybe I'll consider giving you this stupid book back. I'm surprised you can even read it. Slab. Can't you see I'm trying to read? Trying. Jeez. What have you got to... Sorry. The... 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 Let me know when you get to the third sentence. That I'll armor is pretty sweet. Not as sweet as mine. Slab. <laughs> okay then, Freddy Krueger. We'll go this way. So what are we supposed to be doing then? Because I don't see... Is it this door we're supposed to be going through? Mm. Mm, nope. Uh, no, wait a minute. We haven't been here yet, have we? Aha! Uh -huh. There's our nether uh -huh. portal. Hey there, face meat. Um, hello? Don't you hello, face meat. <laughs> Wait a minute, you're the cheater that blew up my friend, Slab! Yeah. And face meat doesn't work. Cheaters, don't stand around breathing up all of face meat's air. Face meat prefers dweeb free air. Do you know where my friends are? In the mines. Duh. <laughs> and they're not going anywhere. Not on face meat's watch. That doesn't mean just stand there. Staring at face meat. Please, what can I do to get them out? Well, now that you mention it, Facemeat was busy slamming mad reps at the gym and missed lunchtime. You see? So Facemeat's hungry. Do something about that, and Facemeat will think about getting your friends out. <laughs> Let's go and talk to old uh, Matilda over here. It's you again! Yep. The one I wanted to make suffer! Hey, leave before I ruin you. Would it be possible for me to uh, have some of that bread? It's for that guy over there. Seriously? I'm not falling for that. No bread until lunchtime. Get out of here before I make you into a meal. Does anyone have any food I can borrow or 
will have? I guess I should ask around. I just did that. I've got... Oh, actually, she said if, if so, we can do to help us, she will, didn't she? So let's go and ask... Bra! She could do with another trouser leg back, look of it. Yo, Jesse, what can I help you with? Oh, hey, I don't no, know. No, I mean, seriously. I mean, anything at all. Like, I want to help out people. Well, actually, do you have any extra food? Well, um, if I had some wheat, I would totally give you some. Sadly, I don't have a secret stash. And if you didn't ask, I wouldn't loan you some. Wink. <laughs> Come on, uh, quick before anybody sees what the us. Fuck? A yes would have been would have sufficed. Go ahead. That should be enough for your bread. All of it? Of course, bra. It'll grow back. Just uh leave the seeds, yeah? Planting as I go. And that's another. <laughs> Sweet! And that should all Sweet. grow back soon. Sweet! Nice! Looks like that should be enough for some epic loafage. <laughs> and what's crafting table? Yeah, uh, that means bread. Hopefully bread will be enough to get that face meat guy to help me. Righteous. They don't let us use crafting tables, though. Right, so what am I supposed to do? Wait, I saw a few wood planks by the dojo. Right on. Thank you, Nell. Hey, no prob. Happy to help. Catch you later, yeah? Catch you later, yeah? Let's go and get these planks, brah! Hoo ya! Hey! There, that should be enough for a table. Boom! Ah, that's some fine crafting. Let's make some food. That's fine crafting of a crafting table. Bread is free. We are crossing a line. So one, two, three. Yeah! Boom! I thought you needed an oven. Boom! For bread. bread. Now I should be able to get my friends back. I like his, if he keeps his end at bargain, you will. Mm -hmm. Which, that doesn't fill me with confidence at all. Um, hello? <laughs> hey, face me. Got some bread for you. Bread, huh? <laughs> it's not cake, but face meat is starving. Mmm, it's so warm. Oh, and full of carbs. Please get my friends. <laughs> Face meat appreciates the politeness. Hang on. <laughs> hey, Petra. Hey, glad to see you already figured out the whole nether portal thing. Lucas and Ivor should be right out. One of those huge guys is getting them for me. Nice, uh, nice. But it doesn't go to plan. A bit surprised. Well, it seems like we keep ending up in situations. First with Palma, now with that stupid... Sploof game. Well, what I'm trying to say is, thanks. You know, don't make this awkward. It was just on my mind, and I thought I should say something. I did what I had to do. Well, I appreciate it. I'm glad you're with me in this, Petra. Me too. Oh. Oh. Yay! <laughs> Jesse, man, is it good to see you? You too, Lucas. And Ivor. Oh my god. Uh, what are you wearing? Right. Shut up. My outfit breathes wonderfully. Anyway, how's it been going out here? You, uh, you don't have our stuff by any chance, do you? He's worried about his diary. Uh, I'm working uh -huh. on that. It's tricky, though. Well, don't beat around the bush. What has Harper gotten us wrapped up in? Yeah, Harper is a tricky one. 
long as we stick together, it's going to be fine. We'll either get the Atlas and go home, or we'll be stuck in the nether together forever. That is not reassuring, Jesse. <laughs> hey, Jesse, I need to talk. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty bad in there, Jesse. They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just uh, stare at you while you mine. It's been terrible. And we weren't in there that long. Lucas, I'm sorry. We can't just leave. We made a deal. We have two more games to compete in. Well, hopefully we can get that over with quick. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. Guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire <laughs> team tall. across the finish line. Yeah, it's super fishy. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. Like I said, he may be able to help. Oh, I didn't think he'd come back. Hey, now! <laughs> I said he would help. That's why we're here. Harper's been filling me in about you. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. Oh, that's a great. real wild Fans. card. That's, as long as we can amuse you lot. I think you might be a real Tim in the making. We don't want to yep. be a Tim. A we want to go real home. Tim. Fuck wait. Really interesting. Yeah, here to amuse you. You being here, I can feel change in the air. Whatever, as long as you don't cheat. Cheat? Oh, no, 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 no. That would never do. Not as long as I'm around. In fact, I'm going to make it my personal mission to make sure Hadrian plays by the book. You'll see. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. Can we trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, uh, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Ah, oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm winning and getting us all out of here. I wonder what you the next all. event will be. Hopefully nothing too deadly. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't take you seriously looking like that. It breathes. <laughs> Wonderfully! <laughs> it breathes. Old friggin' climber cool legs. Hello, competitors, and welcome to the next day of the games. <laughs> it's gonna be a hot one. Woo! Yes, it is, Adrian. And how are our teams looking, Otto? Well, Mevia, purple, green, and yellow are still making a strong showing. But after yesterday's performance in Sleep, I'm afraid to say that the red team has been completely eliminated. Oh. I guess it's back to the mines for them. <laughs> and of course about our plucky newcomers. Otto, shut up. We don't need to hear about them. Well, for everyone else, don't forget to be like Tim out there. <laughs> oh, Tim. I wonder how this is going to go. These other losers don't look so tough. Yep, it's going to be a good one. I can feel it. All right, I can get behind that kind of optimism. No idea what this event is. I'm sure we'll kick butt. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. Time to head to the starting line. Starting line, huh? A race. We've totally got this. <laughs> I'm going got off. this, huh? Boom. Surprise locker room visit. Ah. How we doing, everybody? Got any more hair it's Adrian. Potion. And here are the newcomers that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ. What's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. We have appearances to keep up here. I'm just looking forward to a fair contest where the best person wins. Well, listen to this little pillar of nobility, huh? Don't you worry. That's what these games are all about. Just ask Tim. I admire your confidence, Jesse, but I must ask, what makes you think you can win? 
but so many others have failed. Huh? Do you really think you're special? I think we can win because you're not as good as you think you are. You're cocky. Well, aren't you some bold little so-and-sos? Watching you burn is going to be extra satisfying. <laughs> what a lovely day for a game. Jesse, good luck out there. I'm sure you'll be great, but, uh, well, everyone could always use a little dose of luck, right? Thanks, Em. Good luck to you, too. Of course. I saw what you could do in Spleef. Then you made that deal with Hadrian, and I thought, whew, an enemy of my enemy is my friend. Em might be up to something. So, uh, yeah. How about we work together on this? No, 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 I no. could use an ally. And you could use my help. <sighs> come on, Jesse. I'm trying to help you out here. Like a mutual agreement. Oh, come on, Em. You expect me to believe that? What are you up to here? Nothing, honest. It's just watching you negotiate with Hadrian, trying to get home. It inspired me. Yeah, coffee. And you want to go home, too. We should be working together. In the middle of the race is a park with tons of gladiators. That's when we should all team up. Defeat them, then race to the finish. Well, what do you say? Unless you don't want the help of a former gladiator. I mean, that's okay too. You got a deal. Good. I won't let you down. Competitors, to the starting line. Meet you at Gladiator Junction. Gladiator Junction? Hey, what, what that sounds awesome. Down? At least we won't have to fight her and the gladiators. Oh, will we? I'm ready for this. Those gladiators are going down. Hint, it's going to involve a lot of punching and kicking. Remember, there's no I in teamwork, Petra. Yeah, but there is a me, and I'm going to kick their butts. <laughs> <laughs> All right, helmet. Keep your knob on. You've not won it yet. Psst, Jesse. I just like wanted to say it's like an honor to be working together. And I'm glad that M like, totally suggested that. We can do this. Uh, yeah. I knew that you were cool from the moment we met. Competitors, on your mark. Get set. Go! Go! Whoa! Oh. Woo! Let's go! Whoa! Whoa! Ah. Hell yeah! Motherfucker! Oh no! Go, 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 go! Oh no! Wow! We did it! This has been pretty tough! Can't wait to see what else they throw at us! What did we get ourselves into? And you're just getting started! Huh? Whoa! Out of the way, Move it! Ass bandit! Hi! No! So no! did you slide on your face? What? I pressed the button? Not quite. Nice try, knob rat. Yeah, where's Petra gone? Oh, she's there. Whoa. Now we're back in the arena, aren't we? Okay, sounds like this is Gladiator Junction, but where are the gladiators? Here they are! <laughs> oh, that answers that question. Oh, oh shit. Oh, Move, move! <laughs> oh, 
Oh yeah, that doesn't look like it hurts at all, does it? <laughs> yeah, works. Jesse, what's up? You ready for the fun part? Oh I yeah. Sure hope so. Come on then. <laughs> <laughs> hey there, motherfucker! I've been about this since oh, I'm gonna yes, punch that tash off your face! Outnumbered. Just means more fun for me. We'll see about that, right, Em? Fucking army, innit? Oh. <laughs> I fucking knew it! Bye, squishy. Nice try. Jesse, got your back! Go! Go! Come in! Looks like you're all alone yeah, now. That's mad. Tired of you, slab. I was just thinking the same thing about you. <laughs> Oh, two on one. Is that how you fucking play then, yeah? <laughs> <Here comes. laughs> oh, sake, man. Come on. Fucking dragging it out. Yeah, look at her running off. Yeah. Fucking little okay. slag. Maybe I can still win this thing. I thought she was supposed to be a friend. Dude, I am like so close. I could do this. Sorry, now I'm winning this thing. When you're ready. When you're ready. Oh, come on, man. Hey, whoa, whoa, Jesse. Way to catch up, dude. Very nice. You just can't take a hit, can you? Get huh? dunked on. Whoa, slacker. Oh, my whoa. God. No! Come on, Nell, let up. No, 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 no. Are you joking? Dude, that was so Tim. <laughs> right, would you want to hurry up? Look, they're fucking talking. How are we going to get out of here? Oh, the water, little dude. We can ride that wave right back up to the top. Follow me. Alright, come on. Help a bit, fucking keep the uh, control. Like, Ooh, man, intense enough for you? In order, you know, so it's same yeah, thing. Don't each time. It. I had a feeling she'd fucking betray us, but it was worth this a try. This race is man. almost over, and we will soon have a winner. And I think I know who it might be. I am the winner of the lava race, the gladiator, formerly known as Emily. I trust you made good on our deal. I did. If that's true, then why hasn't Jesse respond yet? Yeah, why aren't they? Because he's here! Cheating, bitch. Jesse. And there appears to be a confrontation on the field. You tried to kill me! I... Two. Oh, yeah. So you sacrificed winning the race to save someone else. Good to know. And you. You were supposed to eliminate Jesse. Our deal's off. Deal? No, no, please. And I thought he was going to make it, make sure it was fair. I think I'm scum or whatever, but you know what? I don't even care. You ask them. You have your deal, Jesse. If you win, you and your friends will just leave us anyway. My shot at going home just went up in smoke. So feel free to judge all you want. Hard to hurt me any more than Hadrian did just now. You really trusted Hadrian? That guy's like a creeper in a purple power suit. Hey, you try being stuck here as long as I have. Then you can talk. I'm out of here. Okay, respawning is the worst. And where's the armor? You. Hadrian wants you. 
Hadrian? Why does he want to see me? You made him real mad. Come on. I don't have all day. I'm warning you, Jesse. Before I go anywhere, I want more information. And I wanted to kill you, but they wouldn't let me. So? Guess that means we don't always get what we want. Come on. No. Just Jesse. Hadrian oh, doesn't allow pushing? dirty respawns in the palace. Fucking hell, okay. mate, fuck. Well, be safe, Jesse. I don't trust them. Hmm. Hey, psst. I need to talk to you. Keep up. Come on. Come here. It'll be All quick. Right, matter, Jesse, um, thingy, you innit? do what I say or not. Hey, uh, Jesse. Status yeah, quo. Over here. Jesse, I'm warning you. I think you're going to wait for me, lackey. I mean, what are you going to do? Kill me? Oh, wait. I forgot. You can't. Hey, what's <laughs> up? Hi, Jesse. I'm Sebastian. Um... Uh, um, I know you're about to see the video. old builders, and I just wanted to say, please, Money for nothing just that. don't make them mad. Whatever they want you to do, just do it. It is way worse for us when they're mad. We're just happy you're here. I know, you're so busy. I, I'm just a minor. Come on, Sebastian. They're not going to make things any worse as long as I'm around. You haven't been here when Mevia starts throwing a TNT tantrum from up there. Yikes. Yeah, it's not fun. I don't want to keep you, but some of the miners and I, well, we made you something. I know it's not much, but it's all we have. Wow, thank you. You didn't have to do this. Jesse, come on! <laughs> now we're going to be late and I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs> just the most not cool. Yeah, sorry about that. I just really wanted to hear what that guy had to say. <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> Mother, I'm talking now because I didn't get my own way, and you didn't do what I wanted you to do. Wow, so this is how the old builders live. Yeah, while well, all of us are fucking tolling away, totally man. It's about right, right, isn't it? Sometimes I just like to stand here and. Hmm. <sighs> Just do that a whole bunch. This is incredible. Such amazing use of scale and angles. Right? <laughs> Knew you'd be impressed. I get to hang out here whenever I want. But why am I standing around? I gotta go find Hadrian. Thanks to you, we're late. Oh, and don't touch anything. This is God. Slab said God don't God. touch anything. He never said don't look at everything. <laughs> and do we really care what Slab said? No portal, Atlas. A man forever voyaging by Soren, another one? Where what's do these keep coming that? from? What's that on window over there? This? What's that? Now that's a view. Hey, there's Petra and Lucas. Psst, hey, Bat. Hey, Batsy. Oops. That's what it was, a bat. I've never seen a quartz desk before. Well, you have now. All from the blood, sweat, and tears of all people that he's got slaving for him. I'm, oh, what he? Wow, an all tin, quartz then. wall. What eating? The, the Adrian. That's his armor. That's that tin's armor, isn't it? Tin, tin, whatever his name was. Hey, that's that Tim guy's armor. Welcome, Jesse. Fantastic to have you here. Just fantastic. Thanks for accepting my invitation. Well, it seems appropriate that you'd gravitate toward Tim's armor. What with everyone calling you the new Tim down there. Yes, I've heard the rumors that they're calling you that, and I can definitely see why. People love an underdog story. The decor of this place really seems like you're going for a modern villain aesthetic. Does it? I suppose taste can be intimidating to the classless. 
You can look closer, go ahead. I assume by now you've heard all about Tim. Repeatedly. Everyone loves him. And why shouldn't they? After all, he's Tim. Yeah, it seems like he really gives them hope. Even better than that. They really believe in him. Tim is an inspiration to them, even when he's not here. One could say he's an inspiration because he's not here. What do you mean? It's so much easier for a legend to stay nice and shiny when it's a fond memory. Easier to control it. I've been watching your legend grow, but I worry that with you still in the picture, it could get... messy. I've been starting to think it would be best if you made a quiet exit. You don't belong here. These games aren't for you. Tell me something, Hadrian. Do you even have a point when you start talking? Or you just hope to find one along the way? Because I'm getting really tired of listening to you blab. Whoa, wow, well, that's just kind of rude, champ. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't you heard that patience is a virtue? See, there's something you should know about the games. No one ever wins unless we want them to. Not even Tim. Let that sink in for a moment, eh? I'm not buying it, Hadrian. Is Tim even real? I knew you were a smart one, bucko. Hmm. Of course he's not real. Tim gives them hope. He keeps them playing the games, but no one wins. Ever. Which is why I think it'd be in your best interest to play alone. But don't you miss your friends? Your a bit like, house? uh... Wait, real my society, treehouse? Uh, I've not the known Atlas anyone that's ever won big on lottery. I so I had Mevia go check it out. I mean, you reach out, out, you're we know pretty famous. Real. I was impressed. How to bring back some things you might be interested in. <laughs> I've heard of people winning a few thousand Axel, there and there. Olivia! Stuff. But I've never hey, known Jesse. anyone. Oh my gosh, I can't believe you're here. Big. Yeah, this really scary lady showed up and knocked us out. Now we're in these smelly boxes. What's going on here? And that guy's voice is the worst. I can even hear it through the obsidian. I'm gonna get you guys free, I promise. It's great to hear that you're not a prisoner, at least. Well, I kind of am. Different. Oh. I'm just glad we're all back together. Wait until I tell the others you're here. I've missed you guys so much. Wow, this is just, wow. Such a tapestry of human trauma and emotion. And we haven't even gotten to the best part. I saved that for last. What? Oh, yes. Your best friend. Reuben. Oh. Sup? I've heard all about him. Your best friend. Your partner in crime. Uh, hi, Reuben. Oh, what's up? Nothing too much. How about yourself? Oh, same. This is so awkward. So you used the Atlas to kidnap all my best friends. Why? Yeah, incentive, Jesse. Incentive. See, even if you win, and that's a mighty big if, they will be staying to work in the mines forever. Or until they get a shot at competing, which is still basically forever. No! Okay, so what's your deal? If you lose the next match and go work in my mines, then I'll let your friends go. All of them. You'll just have to stay behind in their place. I hear it's terrible in those mines. But aren't your friends worth it? You're messing with the wrong guy. And his friends. Yeah, they're awesome. Just being supportive? I'm not messing with anyone. I'm just trying to maintain my games here. Okay, I had hoped that watching your sad reunion would be entertaining, but I'm done now. What do you say, sport? Your freedom for theirs, huh? Do you think you're worth more than all of them? No way, Hadrian. I don't make deals with cheaters. Fine. Play it your way. Which is to say, I will crush you, and you won't win anyway. Slab, get this garbage out of my office. Sure thing, boss. Come on, idiot. Uh, uh.
Well, that just made it a bit more fucking interesting, didn't it? <laughs> and what happened to this uh, other builder Jesse, that we're going to okay. make sure that there were no cheating? What happened up there? Hadrian has Axel and Olivia. What? what? He used the Atlas to snatch them from our world. No. Are they okay? Other than Hadrian having them trapped in obsidian prisons. But he offered me a deal. He said he'll send you all home if I lose and go to the mines in your place. <gasps> I didn't take the deal. Oh, I guess that was probably the right move. Probably? <laughs> what, you thought that deal sounded good? I don't know. It's a complex situation. I didn't take the deal because it was a no-win scenario and I don't believe in those. I know we can find another way. I just hope you know what you're doing. <sighs> Jesse was smart. Hadrian never would have kept that deal. Even if you did volunteer to throw the game, he'd just send you all to the mines anyway. Probably, while claiming that was the original deal. So who's supposed to help us then? Hadrian and Mevia are both clearly the worst. But what about the third guy? Otto? How could he help? Well, he said he won't going to let any cheat in. out of the more lever-pulling sides of the games. He seems like a big fan of the rules. Maybe we can use that to our advantage. Huh. He loves rules, that's for sure. Always plays by him. If you won, I know he would definitely make sure you got that atlas. That was the original deal. And he's an honorable man. Harper, what about all the people that are trapped here against their will? I can win the Atlas, but I'm going to need you to get them out. You can count on me, Jesse. I'll make sure everyone is out of the mines before the next game is over. Wait, wait, wait. You really think you can free everyone in this place and win the games? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck with that last part. Do you really think you can just beat all the other teams by yourself? That is a pretty tall order. Even for you, Jesse. The old builders expect us all to fight each other. I don't intend to give them the satisfaction. <laughs> You're what? Gonna convince everyone to work together? Oh, yeah. Whoa. Looks like we've got a little bit of an audience here. <laughs> I think that's your cue to do your thing. Come on. Big talk! Big talk! Tomorrow, if we work together, we can all win together! But Jesse, you're not on my team. See, my jumpsuit is yellow. <laughs> That's just what the old builders want you to think. Hadrian keeps twisting and changing the rules. I say it's our time to change the rules on them! What's the point? Hadrian will still have all the power. There's no way he's gonna let us just take that from him. He'll just make up some new rule. Don't you want to go home, Em? I do. More than anything. Right, then. Nobody beats Hadrian at his own game. Nobody. Hey! Tim did! Yeah. Yeah, don't say That's oh. the only thing keeping me going in here. Oh, yeah. Because if it weren't off for Tim, I probably would have given up a long time ago. Actually, Tim's not real. <gasps> That's... No way. Of course Tim's real. Look at the banners. Are you sure? Yeah, Hadrian told me. <gasps> I knew it. All of that stuff about him seems so implausible. So wait, Tim's made up. Yeah. They just invented him. What a highly elaborate fabrication. Of course he is. It's all a part of how the old builders keep their control over everyone. That's awful. Seriously. But we can beat them. The old builders already controlled everything else. Of course they control the games. Why should I even try anymore? Sitting in their stupid tower, pulling all the levers. Like they've got us all on leashes. I thought you were one of the toughest people in here, Em. What's the matter? Are you scared? Gasp. Is that what it is? <laughs> Are you scared? What? No. <laughs> I just don't want to keep getting hit by stupid gladiators with enchanted swords if I can't win anyway. Yeah, I mean, like, your plan to take down the old builders sounds cool and all, but, um, those gladiators are, like, super tough. <laughs> like, max level scariness, okay? Boo! Oh, no, no, I mean, totally OP. Yeah, but so are we, you guys. Sure, their fists are huge and their weapons are really scary, but we've all got fists and stuff, too. Uh, where's Jesse going with this? 
if we combine all of our fists and stuff, we're going to be like ten times as tough as the gladiators. Oh, I get it now. Okay, now just bring it home, Jesse. You can do it! Doing awesome. We can do this! We don't need Tim because we are Tim! Yeah! <laughs> Not real? I can't believe it! <laughs> Look, it was a nice speech. But strength doesn't come from speeches. Actions speak louder than words. Can't expect you to just talk your way through this, Jesse. Strength comes from believing in yourself, Em. Sounds like a bunch of nonsense, Jesse. Sorry. Man, some crowd. Think they got through to him? Wait, so who are we fighting then? <laughs> the action definitely seemed mixed. Yeah, no kidding. A lot of diehard Tim fans. Uh, yeah, totally. I mean, you did hear it, right? Loud and clear. It just might not have been enough. Well, I guess we'll find out for sure in the morning. <sighs> Well, did what I could. Did you know, you're not dealing with brightest bulbs in fucking box, eh? Because they've been doing that for all that time and not real. None of them realised that it was actually a fix and they were just being Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege, <sighs> nay, my honour, to be here today, kicking off another wonderful day. Because it's a bit like real society. The game. That's right, Adrian, and not just any day. But the being controlled and steered in a certain direction for that long. Are our People, even when you tell them and point it out to them, the think world. you're the mental one. That's how fucking programmed so, they are. Scared? Because it's okay if you are. No one will judge you for it. After putting up with your breath this whole walk? Please. <laughs> This walls thing doesn't scare me at all. <laughs> Still got your sense of humor, huh? Cute. Bevia, for those unfamiliar with... The walls. You want to walk us through how it's played? Sure thing, Hadrian. Teams start out separated in their own sections, divided by the high inner walls. Each team has a short amount of time to gather materials, build defenses, and craft in their section before the walls come yeah. down. Wait, I only see dirt and gravel in my section. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that going to be a problem? The sections are drawn at random. Whatever, I'll make it work. I'm that awesome. Oh, can't wait. <laughs> I'm that awesome. Down, it's every team for themselves. But is surviving the walls the end? Why is he on his own? No, it is not, Hadrian. Whichever team survives the free-for-all needs to step onto the winner's platform in the center of the arena. Winner takes all. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Because that's only if the would-be winners can defeat oh, Gladiator! <laughs> that's right! So all competitors better get to gathering materials because that clock is ticking! Too dark. Well, hopefully it's not all dirt and gravel. Ah, oh, choices are funny, aren't they, Mevian? Alright, so where am I what supposed to be going? You mean, Hadrian? Oh, that? Some choices take you places. Others get you nothing but dirt. Gravel? Gravel, that's worse than dirt. Ah. <laughs> oh, it's true, it's true. Come on, for fuck's sake. I'm guessing that's the eponymous wall. Well, yeah, it's a wall. Nope, just dirt. Oh, come on, what am I supposed to fucking do here? Yep, just dirt. Just dirt. If I didn't convince people to join up with that speech, I'm gonna need something to work with. Oh my god. Hey. <laughs> Seems like they're happy you didn't get anything. <laughs> I think they're making fun of you. But just my, you know, professional opinion. There's a gladiator. Who's heard this a lot? Nah. Oh, you think? Well, yeah, I do actually. Rhetorical question. Mm, what oh, about? do you know what time it is? Ask me what time it is, Mavia. What time is it, Hadrian? It's time for the walls to come down. Uh. This should be interesting. 
I don't even get what we're supposed to do now. What? I don't understand. What? The competitors are like wild ocelots sizing each other up. Oh, you have to make weapons then. Before they go in for the kill. Jesse! You! Jess! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Really? Looks like the gladiator formerly known as Emily is preparing her attack. And Jesse, the newcomer, is just painfully unarmed and unprotected. Jesse. This could get ugly. You seem pretty sure you're about to kill me. Are you with us or not? Oh, ye of little faith. Jesse isn't even trying to defend himself. Hey, nice one. Yeah, fuck you. I believe it in myself for once and take a chance. It appears Emily has opted to not. Thank you. You made the right decision. Well, you could say you really inspired me. Oh, that's good. But don't. What is that doing? Fucking shut up, you little penis. Come on. You've been uncovered for what you are, you little fucking using cum. Yeah. Why aren't you all killing each other? Chill. We're all killing now, you. I can totally see why you'd be confused. Yeah, we're uh, confused. I mean, usually the little teams all kill each other, you know? Aren't you tired of letting the old builders use you like this? Like, uh, like awesome people? No. No, like little pieces in their games doing whatever they say. Don't you see? None of us are the enemy. It's them. They're the enemies. They're behind everything. Oh, my head hurts. <laughs> Too many perspectives. <laughs> it appears that gladiators are being idiots right now. Uh. Idiots. When what they should be doing is eliminated. These aren't your games anymore, Hadrian. Uh, uh, these weren't our games? Wow. My urge to destroy is dissipating. Oh, imbeciles. Slab? What should we do? Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I'm sure that the slaughter will commence soon, right? You should be on our side. Join us. I don't know. Facebook finds that idea weird. <laughs> Not going with them, Slab? In my life, I've done some things I'm not proud of. But I won't work for bosses who use people or manipulate Yay. people. Yay! Come on! Slam See, this is the sort of ending you should get. Not like the fucking you made me shit. Late when I was just trying to do my job, and that was real inconsiderate too. And then you really rubbed it in my face, reminding me I couldn't kill you. Hmm. Even though I really wanted to at the time. But I think I need some time to be my own boss. <laughs> I think it's time for us to finish this. Together. Yeah, like the it appears Game of Thrones, the where you just got the took piss out of all the way through, and then didn't rules. even get a good ending. Anyone who is not eliminated may step on the victory platform and win the game. Come on, then. It looks like they are going to do this together. Yeah. Fearless leader. <laughs> that won't happen. It can't happen. No. No. Shut up, Adrian, you little fucking pussy. And they. Yeah, got to my back. Got to my back. Fucking control freak. Which I'm sure my colleague means to say we are going to find some way to disqualify them. No, we no, are not. We are they not. all win. No! Levia, Otto, with me. We're ending this. See what I mean? They just can't act So it. help me, none of you will leave this place until you eliminate each other. Not happening. Oh, would you cut it out with the cheating and bending the rules already? I heard Mevia. The game ends when someone steps on the winner's platform. Boom. Jesse's got a point. Yeah. This isn't up to you. We control the game. No, you don't. Not outcome. anymore. Mevia. Shut up, Otto. This runt needs to pay for ruining our fun. So you admit the games are rigged then? <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Sure. Fine. Whatever. Mevia. There you Jesse go. Jesse won these games fair and square. He's earned the Atlas. 
Yep. Uh -oh. I would think very carefully about what you're doing. I have. Jesse, with the power vested in me as an officiator of the Builder Games, I am proud to pay. Oh, the you fucking joke. Look at him. Little you? control freak. Now Kill him. Fun, really? But I think it's about time we end this. Try so, it. This is majorly bogus, dudes. Surrender the redstone heart now. Kill them, they're all because, fucking... Uh, I will trap you here, forever. If you want it, come and get it. Your wish is my command, <laughs> Oh, because he... So the the really old, but they can build really well, fast like that. Just when you thought M had... M, come back! <laughs> now that you've lost your oversized friend, you really don't stand a chance. Run away, little Emily. You're gonna need all the help you could get, Jesse. Is that right? To take what is mine. Oh, oh cheating little quick. bastard. Look at him, he just cheats I'm everything. For my axe. Oh, what the? Don't forget my axe, Hadrian. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking grot bag. <laughs> Well, I'm like having to whoa. It's not letting me do anything at all. Kid. You basically just got to get you killed. You got skills, but you're still no. Let's see about that. I got this, Hadrian. Or is it one of them where you've got to nearly die and then you'll come back like Rocky? Had enough, Hadrian? Wait, wait. You're right. This has gone too far. It was just supposed to. Yeah, be all right. You expect me to believe that? Come on, sport. Haven't you ever had anything get away from you before? I mean, can't you forgive me? <laughs> <laughs> oh my this fucking god. Is... No! What? Well, that's our game, sports fan. He didn't even give me out to uh, stop the thing. has been returned to its proper owners. Are you fucking joking me? <laughs> I, I lost. It's over. I... Oh, I don't think so. It's us. Yeah. I'm so happy <sighs> to see you guys. You said you believed in me, Jesse. And Did you, you ran off. Did you return the favor and believe in everyone else? You know, because I'm awesome. And we both need to get out of this. Oh, I knew you'd be back. Thanks for not doubting me. <laughs> I did I doubt you. I inventory when I respawned. How am I supposed to get the Atlas back without any weapons or armor or anything? Well, we may have made a little stop in Hadrian's inventory room and helped ourselves <laughs> to a few things. Awesome. Here, buddy. Wow. Take this. Thanks. Hey, Suspender! Over here! Oh, no armor. armor. Belongs to you now. Come on, let's get on with it then. Fucking about. Time to kick some old builder butt. Now to pick a weapon to go with my sweet new armor. Uh, let's go with Axe, eh? Ooh, yeah. nice choice. Not bad. Sweet. Payback time. Eliminate! Now what should we do with all those other competitors who betrayed us? Well, Mevia, spending eternity in the quartz mines doesn't seem like punishment enough. <laughs> I have something special in mind for them. Hello? Adrian, Mevia, this game just went into overtime. Well, isn't that cute? You found Tim's armor. Oh, well, isn't that just the sweetest thing, Hadrian? You don't know my friends, Hadrian. Those friends of yours will just hold you back in the end, slugger. Oh, I'm going to enjoy crushing you. Now it's my turn, motherfucker. Fuck you, little bearded piss flap. Oh, here she goes, little fucking protector. Get your fucking tongue out of his asshole. Fucking grot bags. Get fucked up. <laughs> oh, here we go, for fucking hell, fire's sake. No one 
Are you sure about that, you little fucking tool? Oh, I thought no one could get out of obsidian. No, it can't be! You just made me a give up! Silly bitch. Silly little cow. Wow, her inventory was huge. Yeah, because all what she nicked up every con else. What kind of rookie move was that? What? Here we go. Big hard bastard. Why has it changed to a sword? I don't know. Come on! You fucking press the button and it still pushes you over anyway! What's the point? The order of the stone. You mess with all Go, of Jesse. I believe ooh, you ooh, 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 ooh. You take this as going to help? No, 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 You little fucking weirdo. Come on, watch him fucking pull some art bag or something. Oh, he didn't. Oh. You and your stupid deals! There's no time for that now, Mevia. We have to get out of here. Come on! No, you need to go and work down mines. That's what you need to do. Whoa! Potty turn it. Hey! Hey! Guys, go on, talk your way out of that. How's it going? <laughs> it's going not the best, and you're not going anywhere. Yeah. Face Meat wants to discuss his benefits plan. <laughs> oh, hang on, Jesse, you did it again. Feels like I we say that a lot. Did it. I couldn't have done anything without all of you. Exactly. Well done, Jesse. An excellent job. Uh, thanks, Otto. It's you have truly shown Tim my friends Tim. and I the error of our ways. I'm glad to put this whole messy business behind us. Start over. Correction, Otto. We all showed you the error of your way. Uh, yes, I suppose you're right. You all showed us. And you all deserve to go home. <laughs> <laughs> you have fairly defeated them. Seems only fair that you get to decide their fate, and with the Atlas, you can send them anywhere you want. Oh. Hmm. You know, there was this game that Olivia and I used to play back in our treehouse. Huh? Remember? We called it, Which Would You Rather Fight? Oh, we'll send them to where all zombies are. And that, uh, where that mansion was. And that's when I yanked Pama's redstone heart right out. And the whole thing shut down. Man, you guys have had some crazy adventures. So many people trying to kill you. Goodbye, Jesse. Goodbye. Thank you. <laughs> that all of them? Everyone that wants to go home anyhow. Except you folks, that is. I can't believe how many competitors actually want to stay and keep playing the games. <laughs> yeah, but fairly. Thanks to you, my intrepid new friend, I can actually work on making them fun again. Very exciting. It'll be more challenging just by myself, but a good challenge. You promise they'll stay fun this time, right? Oh, yes. I don't intend to let the games get corrupted like they did before. I'm bummed my journal never showed up. Had a lot of good stuff in there. Yeah, I'm sorry, Lucas. Well, Em, how about you? You said you wanted to go home, right? Yes, I just can't decide if it's what I want. <laughs> you get to leave and go on more adventures. Come with Do us, Do I then? really want to go back to farming? I mean, it has been ages since I've seen it, and I miss my friends. Well, if you want, you can come with us. Oh, huh, really? Like, really? <laughs> yeah, we could always use another awesome person, and... Well, you're pretty awesome. Ah, oh, Jesse! That's wonderful! Oh, thank you so much! Hey, Ivor. Oh, hello! What you doing? 
I was just observing Harper, all by herself over there. <laughs> she seems lonely. Come on. <laughs> hey, Harper. Oh, hey, Jesse, Ivor. I was just watching folks head on home. Things really worked out, huh? Well, I guess this is goodbye. I'm gonna head on back to Crown Mesa and see how the Post Palma construction is going. Just hope they'll take me back. It's not my real home, but it's the closest thing I've had for, well, a long time. We'll just go with that. Just try not to do anything stupid, okay? You don't want to make it worse. Oh, I agree with you there. <laughs> I've realized my instincts aren't always the best. <laughs> Hopefully, I can help people in a way that actually helps them this time. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Getting over the I was a bad guy hump can be awkward, but hopefully soon they'll invite you right back into their lives. Right, Jesse? <laughs> you are a strange, strange man, Ivor. But you know something? You're okay. <laughs> Take care of each Send other. Send me on. Right? And I'll see you around. Bye, Harper. Um, Ivor yes, the bomber. Goodbye. Come on. Come on, Ivor. You're amazing. <laughs> so, how do we get home now? Well, the Atlas I belongs why to he Jesse now. Why he got his deal's his a deal and all thing that. Back. Sweet. Uh, how does it work? Now you just say where you want to go, and the Atlas will show you the There's way. There's no place like Why home. Why don't you just go ahead and There's no place like it. home. There's no okay, place book. like home. Take us home. Boom! Whoa! Spectacular! Incredible! Wow. Hell yeah! How oh, is that home? Then? There it is. It better be. Home. Home. I assume M told you that she's coming with? Yeah, she's already promised to show me that awesome spin move. <laughs> it's not so great. Figure it's about time we get heading on home, huh? That sounds awesome. <laughs> yeah! Home, here we come. Woo! Watch it be freaking dinosaur world or something and they all get munched on as soon as they come out by a T-Rex. Oh no, is it's their uh, temple in it with all the stuff in it. <laughs> Jesse, look! Can you believe it? We made it, we're home! <laughs> She's probably buzzing. After no one. all that time, all those portals, we're home. Yeah, and I couldn't have done it without you guys. You're the best team anyone could ever ask for. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, you big <laughs> sap. I'm just so glad we're all back together. That atlas is so cool. I'm glad Otto let you keep it. Fabulous, yes. And that's not all we got. Seriously? What else did you get? Yeah, show him, Jesse. Aha. Uh... Palma's redstone heart. I know that Palma was evil and everything, but I still kind of wish I could have seen it. Pumpkin. The mask of Cassie Rose, a.k.a. the White Pumpkin. Oh, man. That's even creepier looking than I imagined. The... The crown of the Eversource, the magical source of all of Sky City's precious materials. Whoa, wicked! <laughs> the enchanted flint and steel. The one that started the whole thing. Yeah, none of these other adventures could have happened if it weren't for this. The Portal Atlas. <sighs> I could have lost all the rest so long as we got to keep that. <laughs> I wonder what Soren would have thought of it. So much power contained within such a tiny Whoa. object. Easy there, Ivor. 
<clears throat> Sorry. So that our, that's, I can't believe you that's got to do all those incredible things. That's what makes, makes the whole game you worth it. You were gone it, a long time. Wait till we show you all the improvements like we've been making to town. Improvements to town. Yeah, because we were gone a while. Hang on. Then what is it? Wasn't that where the portal atlas was a minute ago? Yeah, that was definitely where you put it. Guys, Flint and Steel are missing too. Oh, and Ivan. where's Ivor? Ivor. <laughs> he must be headed for the portal network. Is that bad? What should we do? I mean, I guess he mostly knows what he's doing. Come on, guys, we have to catch up with him. <laughs> Adventure time! That's probably where season two comes in. Why would they want to be just back here when they can be out adventuring? <laughs> uh, yes, it was a very good game. I enjoyed it. <laughs> oh, good. I enjoyed that ending. So I wonder then, in season two, which will start tomorrow, if it follows straight on um, with the same characters. I hope it does. Because we've got to know... Obviously, we'll, there'll be new characters and new plots and all that sort of stuff. But I hope it keeps the core characters of the Order of the Stone. Because we've got to know them all now, aren't we? You know what I mean? So I prefer that when you go into a sequel. But I'm sure we'll find out tomorrow when we play it. Episode 1 of Season 2. So, yeah. Other than that, to anyone who's watched it as I've been playing it, thank you very, very much. I really do appreciate you guys. I'm not joking. It's really what we need at the moment to, to build this channel up uh, and get it out there. Because the more that watch it, the more it gets pushed out. It's as simple as that. Um... Because as I said before, it's not about how good your videos are. It's not how, how good you are at editing and all that sort of stuff. That stuff helps for people that are looking for that sort of thing. But what really helps is getting views and stuff like that. Because once you start getting views, the algorithms start pushing you out to more people. So it's like a snowball effect then. Once you get a few views and a few likes and stuff like that, it gets pushed out to more people. So obviously more people see it then, and that means you'll get more likes and more views and stuff. So it just it's a snowball effect. It's just that first slug of getting your channel out there and building it up and finding people that want to be part of your community and stuff. That's what takes the longest. But once you get past that bit, it just snowballs. And that's why most people that have big channels, it's took them 10 years to get it big do you know what i mean because that first slog takes years for you just to get a decent enough following that it really starts getting the wheels moving so yeah so that's why i always stress it at the end of the videos and that how much i really need you guys to join and be part of the emerging gaming community so that i can build it up to something even bigger which hopefully i can then make us all benefit from do you know what i mean it's it's just how it is, you just have to do that. I'm, I mean, I'm doing what I can at my side, like learning the video editing side and trying to uh, uh, put as many videos as I can on so there's some variety on the channel and stuff like that. But And obviously I'm dealing with my own issues of self-esteem and things like that, which I've come a long way since I started doing it. So that's, that's all I can do. The rest of it is down to you guys to build up, you know, the like by liking the videos where any of the videos you watch with a thumbs up button by joining or following whatever it is the Immersion Gaming Facebook page and most of all by clicking the subscribe button on the Immersion Gaming YouTube channel them all them things are completely free to do it'll take a couple of seconds so to you it's just a couple of seconds of clicking a button but to the channel it's huge because that's what's needed for the channel to grow and allow a lot more things to come to the channel. Um, so yeah, if you could do that, I would really, really appreciate it. Um, it means everything at this point. But other than that, we'll just crack on now, get the uh, the credits out of the way, and then we'll wrap it up. And tomorrow, we will start Season 2. So let's just crack on with the credits.
so there we go then season one done and just yet. oh wait a minute it was oh it's where to put them in zombie world on it <laughs> well in a very unfortunate and unexpected turn of events it appears we are in the land of zombies that are indeed the size of chickens <laughs> zombies that are the size of chickens that's right, Adrian. And it looks like they're dying to meet us. <laughs> <laughs> Get it? Weirdo. Because they're undead yeah. and Well, you're they're not dead. funny, love. Never mind. Not your best work. Go find you? a rock to crawl under. Little slime balls. So yeah, there we go then. Um, let me just make sure that there isn't any more. Um, and it, yeah, it does. It does stop at um, eight. So yeah, there we go then. Season one done and dusted. So again, thank you everyone that's joined and watched, and thank you everyone that watches it at a later day as a pre-recorded video. Again, watching is watching. It don't matter whether you watch them live or whether you watch them pre-recorded. By watching, you're supporting the channel. So thank you very much. You are very much appreciated. So until tomorrow. Hopefully you'll come join us for the episode one of season two. So until then, take care of your sins and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye.